Good morning. Welcome back to my channel. It's Carol here and I am at Legree, Maui. I'll see if I can show you what it looks like, but it's in like this, this uh, plaza and it's in the town of Wailea on Maui. It is a, I guess it's, people say it's kind of like Pilates, which I've never done. My dear friend, Danielle, bought me a one day pass to come and check out her workout. So I just rolled out of bed and it's very early. This I got to watch the sunrise from my drive though. It's about a 40 minute drive, but I made it in like 25 minutes. <laughs> I was just worried I was gonna be late, you know? I don't wanna be, I'm just kind of nervous because I've never done this type of workout before. They say it's kind of like Pilates. There's a machine, like a reformer machine, which I'm not familiar with at all, so. I am 30 minutes early, nobody's here, and I'm just kind of getting prepared to go into this class. I've got my water with me. I guess you have to wear special socks that have grippy stuff on the bottom, which I don't have, so I'm gonna purchase some here, which I'm sure they're gonna be, who knows how much. It's We're in kind of a fancy resort town, so anyway, I'm looking forward to the whole, um, the whole experience. My friend Danielle is one of my best friends and she is, she's been doing this for several months, like I want to say like six months or so. And she does it like four or five times a week. She comes to uh, either this location or there's another location in Paia that's about 20 minutes from her house. So she drives every morning at five or 6 a.m. and does this workout and she's hooked. She's loving it. She's looking amazing she is her body has like transformed she's also eating super clean and she's really paying attention to her positive mindset and i've been hanging out with her a lot lately because she's just such a good influence on me she's really doing the work to become the best version of herself she's trying all the things and so why wouldn't i want to try something new i'm all about trying new things meeting new people so i'm excited to give this a try and i don't think i can film in there but maybe i can film a little bit of my beautiful friend Danielle she's very she's tiny it, it's so funny she's uh she comes up to like here on me but I don't even realize because she's such a beautiful uh radiant personality when I'm talking to her and hanging out with her I don't I don't look at her as being smaller or whatever but then I then we take a selfie and it's just really funny how much smaller she is than me but I, you don't notice that when you're talking to someone she appears to be much larger than her stature if that makes any sense but anyway I just love her and I'm excited for this I'm nervous I don't know what I'm doing I'm gonna really try not to hurt myself so I'm gonna just be chill and mellow and I'm not pushing myself at all I'm not in a position where I can push it to the limits here so I'm not proving myself to anybody I am just here for the experience experience. So um, anyway, I'll catch up with you guys in a minute. All right, well, here we are. It's my good friend, Danielle, and we survived up there, Legree, Ooh. Maui, on the top floor. Oh, yeah. We survived, oh, what, yeah. what do you call it, Pilates? Or? It's sort of like Sort Pilates. of like Pilates, yeah. but it was good. We did it, and I survived, and my Girl, legs are like awesome. jello. <laughs> But it was really fun. Thank yeah, you so you much for taking out. me. And look at my dear friend off. Danielle. Look how hot she is. Because she does this stuff. <laughs> All day. Okay, we're gonna go get some coffee. Look how pretty. After we had some coffee, we sat and talked for about an hour, and then we went for a walk on the beach for about another hour. And I wanted to show you this sunflower field that's on my drive home. It's so pretty. People pull over and take pictures there all the time because it's just gorgeous. Hi there, I'm back. That was such a fun class. I would definitely go back and do that again. That was really fun. Afterwards, we went and got a latte that was delicious. We went for a walk on the beach and it was just a wonderful way to spend the morning. It is 12 o'clock and I'm getting pretty hungry. I'm gonna make a chickpea salad and I have some butter lettuce I'm gonna wrap it in. I also have some nori. I'm gonna make like a nori butter lettuce combo. I have a can of chickpeas here. This is just some organic garbanzo beans. I just drained them. I didn't rinse them at all. I just put them in here and oh. My mom got me a potato mash. I haven't owned a potato masher in my adult life. I usually use a fork or a mixer or something else, but I'm gonna go ahead and give this a try here and see if it mashes beans. Oh, wow, it does. 
Okay, so I'm just gonna mash these up. I usually do this in my food processor, but I just don't feel like getting it out. So I, I like them pretty mashed. I just don't like them to roll out of whatever I'm eating. So I like them pretty, pretty squished. Then I have some pickles, uh, green pepper. I'm gonna put in there some green onions and some celery. I always try to add as many veggies as I can to pretty much every dish. It was such a beautiful day at the beach and it was so nice to just walk and hang out with my friend. She's so awesome. Okay, so I've got one green pepper that I diced up. That's going to go in there. You want everything diced pretty small. Okay, I've got a couple of big stalks of celery that I diced. I'm going for 50-50 veggies and beans. I'm going to a clothing swap with some friends, some new friends. I only know one person. Well, I do CrossFit with some of the ladies, but i excited for that. So I'm gonna go through my closet and get rid of everything I haven't worn in the last year. I'm gonna put a splash of pickle juice in here. I just love pickles. You can really put anything in here that you like. You can put uh, red pepper, cucumbers, tomatoes, baby spinach, really whatever you like. I've made this all sorts of ways. I put like a buffalo sauce in it and I really like that, but I don't have any right now. I have some of my potato ranch here that I'll be using as the binder. You can also use avocado to kind of as like the to provide some moisture. Okay, pickles. All right, I'm going to put some fresh ground pepper. some garlic salt, a squirt of mustard, and some of my potato ranch dressing. Woo, wow, that was a lot. All right, let's give this a stir. It smells amazing. If I had some dill, I would put it in here, but I'm out but the pickle juice is gonna make it good. Okay, let's give it a taste. Mmm, 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 mmm. So flavorful. Okay, this is how I feel like eating it today. I've got these nori wraps, beautiful butter lettuce. My brother got me a subscription to a CSA box delivery. Uh, community supported agriculture. So I get a box every Wednesday for three months. So I, I keep thinking it's over and then I get another one. So I may get one this Wednesday or it may be over. I'm not sure, but it's the most beautiful produce. I put some butter lettuce on there and some of my salad. Ooh, that's kind of a lot. All right, then I'm just gonna roll it up. and eat, enjoy. I just love the crunch of these nori wraps and I love the flavor too. And they're really high in iodine, which supports your thyroid health. Mm. Mm -hmm. That is so good. All right, I'm gonna have a few of these and then I'm gonna get to work on my closet. Well, I was at the clothing swap for far too long. Um, it, is all, it is eight o'clock now and I am having some, the same thing I had for lunch, some nori wraps, just because I don't have anything else prepared, I'm hungry. There was some food at the clothing swap, but it was all chips and bread and nothing that I wanted to really eat. So I did have a handful of chips, but um, I, I'm ready to have some veggies and I'm so glad that I have this prepared because this is yummy and I'm excited to eat it. So that's gonna be it for me today, guys. I hope you have a great day and I will see you in the next video.